My name is Keith Woody and I have two students, two children at Brentwood Elementary Magnet School in Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, that school focuses on STEM learning and part of their curriculum is IoT devices such as this Alexa Dot. Um, this dot is what we have at our home in our kids' uh, playroom. Um, in the mornings, um, I would regularly get asked by my children, Caleb and Tyler, whether uh, we were having pizza for lunch or what we were having for breakfast. So I thought a cool skill to build for Alexa was to enable her to be able to tell us the lunch menu for Wake County Schools. So Alexa, open Brentwood Elementary. Welcome to Brentwood Elementary. How may I help you? When are we going to have pizza again? So I developed an app with them and they helped me design what, how we're going to ask the questions and what all she could do. Um, and also helped me type in the menus. They're seven years old so programming is not quite their strong suit yet. But we're, uh, we focused on spelling the words and uh, reading the words and helping me type them in to the database that is uh, enabling the skill so that we can deliver the lunch menu, breakfast menu, or um, actually be able to ask when we're going to have pizza again because kids like to know, you know when their favorite food is the next time. Through the Wakehead Partnership, we got an innovation grant to get uh, Internet of Things um, items like Echo Dots and Smart Home Little Bits uh, robotics pieces. And we are doing a whole fourth grade unit on how they can use the data that they collect and uh, create an Internet of Things um, recipe to have one object talk to another and solve a problem in the school, like tracking how much uh, waste we have or tracking the electricity that we use and connecting it to an Amazon uh, Echo or connecting it to you know, uh, Twitter or connecting it to a robot that will be triggered by uh, some type of data that we collect. So it really fits in perfectly with our um, STEM unit on the internet of everything. We, we spent some time over Christmas break working on this and then I worked with the uh, principal, Mr. Epler, to um, arranged to be here at Tech Night at Brentwood Elementary to demo it for kids and so far it's been a great response. People really like it and ask a lot of questions. Yeah, so we wrote a skill that allows us to ask what's for lunch today or what's for breakfast. What's for lunch next Tuesday? On Tuesday, May 8th, 2018, the cafeteria will serve chicken and mini waffles, hamburger, cheeseburger, baked tater tots, savory green beans, diced pears, assorted fresh fruit.